everyone, my name is Lexi. I'm a naturalist that works at Baltimore Woods Nature Center in Marsalis, New York. This week we're sharing with you some of our favorite memories from nature in the city. So this week I thought for our animal feature we could take a look at the kindergarten lesson because they get a visit from a very special guest. Kindergarten students learn the five things that make something alive. Things that are living need food, water, and air. They also grow and they reproduce or make more of themselves. Once students know these five things, we test their knowledge by holding up different objects or pictures. They give us a thumbs up if it's alive or a thumbs down if it's not alive. Okay, got a school. Is a school alive or not alive? Yeah, thumbs down, not alive. Good job. All right, how about this? Bumblebee, alive or not alive? Yeah. Nice, alive. What about, what about the flower that this bee's on? What do you think about that? Alive or not alive? Yeah, alive, good job. Looks like it's time for the big reveal. We spend the rest of the lesson talking to the students about what makes Geronimo alive and we share a few facts about box turtles. As you can imagine, the students always have a lot of questions to ask about Geronimo. Hmm, so that's a really good question. So Geronimo's shell, it's made out of a similar material to a seashell, okay? It's, it feels really similar and it looks pretty similar. However, Geronimo cannot come out of her shell. So everybody, reach around and feel your spine or your backbone in your back, okay? Can you all feel that? Yeah. So Geronimo's spine, or backbone, just like yours, is attached to her shell. So she cannot come out of her shell because it, it is part of her body. So sometimes in cartoons you see the turtles come out of their shells, but they really can't. We miss going into the classroom to see all of our friends, but we were so happy that they were able to join us virtually. We hope to see them again soon. Thank you so much for checking in with me. Keep up to date on all of our throwbacks for Nature in the City this week um, by following us on social media or you can check out our website, baltimorewoods.org.